Hello YouTube people out there and this is one of my very first tutorials on some easy breezy curly hairstyles that you can make with this particular lace front or any lace front like it and this is the Hollywood Sis CFL H Beal. If I got that name wrong I will put it down in the description box. But let's get started. First of all you want to start by taking this out. <laughs> okay, it was one of the styles that I was thinking about. All right, kind of tangled there a little bit. Okay, you want to start off with this particular unit. The part starts on the side, depending on how you want to do it. Okay, one of the easiest styles to get started would be to do this. You take it up, and this is without having to have any leave out at all. You want to take your bobby pin, which you're going to need, all right, and you want to pin the hair where you want it to go. Okay, and then what you want to do, showing you from the side, you take a beautiful flower like this, which can be purchased at an arts and crafts store in your area, or if you have a downtown area garment district, there may be a little Hawaiian store that might make these. Okay, and you take it and you pin it where your bobby pin is located. And it just takes a little bit of a twist and voila, you've got an easy hairstyle. Okay, now for the next hairstyle, you're just going to need a necklace similar to this if this is the color you're going for. And this is a old uh, South African necklace that I bought from an African store a long time ago. But you don't have to use this. You can use any headband for what I'm about to show you. You'll take this out. You'll take out the bobby pin. And what you will do, you will take the front, lace front, and you will shift it to the middle. Okay? And you want to make sure that all the tangles are out and you do not have to have leave out so what you do you push the hair back you push it back on the other side if you want you can even pin it just to secure it okay with those body pins that I showed you you take this you want to put it back all oh, so far you take these ties put it behind the ear and tie it back okay I'm just going to show you basically this is how it should look okay and as you can see the wig moved a little bit so it will have to be pinned if you've taken the combs out like I have it will have to be pinned so that the hair stays in place and therefore you can put this here and tie it in the back okay so this is another style all right and we've got time for one more and this would be the updo where you want to take it up, pull a few curls down, okay? You want to take it up. It doesn't matter how neat you do it, okay? You're going to take from the temple here, and you can decide if you want it up like this or if you want it back. Either way, it's going to be very pretty with this unit. And this is the type of barrette that I am using for this style. You take it, you pin it like this. Okay, and I will show you in the back on the sides how that looks. All right, and in the back. Okay, so those are some easy styles that you can create with a lace front unit. This unit is synthetic, so that makes it even better. You don't have to spend a lot of money uh, to get a curly unit like this and to make it work for you and get the most of your money's worth out of it. All right, and... Um, those are the styles that I have to show you guys. There's another style also that you can do that is really simple and who wouldn't know about this where you just take it 
you put a hair tie here. You might want to, like I said, bring some hair out on the sides. Bring this hair out on the sides. Okay, and you can put it in the back and make for a very sleek ponytail of this nature here. Okay, and I didn't have a barrette to use for this because it's very thick, but this is also another style that is worth uh, looking into. Okay, and it's very pretty. You have the nice part here, and no one is going to know if this is your hair or not. All right. So